DeepSea Coder is a capable coding model trained on to trillion code and natural language tokens. You can find several DeepSea Coder products from the Matrix Marketplace. You can find the link for the product and the developer guide below in the description. And also you can find the developer guide under the additional resources section of the product page. Since this product needs G-type instances, it is better to check your AWS account's vCPU quota of that server type. You can find the guide link under the prerequisites. Please follow the steps correctly. If you have fulfilled all the prerequisites, you can continue to set up the product. To begin with, click the continue to subscribe button. After subscribing, you will need to accept the terms and conditions. Click on accept terms to proceed. Please wait for a few minutes while the processing takes place. Once it's completed, click on continue to configuration. Select the CloudFormation template for deep sea coder deployment. As the fulfillment option, choose the version and your preferred region. Afterward, click the Continue to Launch button. From the Choose Action drop-down menu and launch this software page. Select Launch CloudFormation and click Launch button. Now we can create CloudFormation stack. Ensure the template is ready radio button is selected under. Prepare template. Click Next. Provide a unique stack name. Provide the admin email for SSL generation. For deployment name, enter a name of your choice. Provide a public domain name for domain name. DeepSea Coder will automatically try to set up SSL based on provided domain name if that domain is hosted on Route 53. Please make sure your domain name is hosted on Route 53. Choose an instance type. Recommended is G5G.16XLarge. Select your preferred key name. Set SSH location as 0.0.0.0/0. Keep subnet CIDR block as 10.0.0.0/24. Keep VPC CIDR block as 10.0.0.0/16. Click Next. Now we can configure stack options. Under Stack Failure Options, select Rollback All Stack Resources. Click Next. Review and verify the details you've entered. Tick the box that says, I acknowledge that a WS CloudFormation might create IAM resources with custom names. Click Submit. Afterward, you'll be directed to the CloudFormation Stacks page. Please wait for 5 to 10 minutes until the stack has been successfully created. Fast forwarding 5 to 10 minutes. After cloud formation is created, we can update DNS. Copy the public IP labeled public IP in the outputs tab. Go to a WS route 53 and navigate to hosted zones. Select the correct hosted zone. From there, click on create record and enter the domain name. Paste the copied public IP address into the value text box and click create record. Now you can access the Deep Sea Coder application through the dashboard you are all provided in the Outputs tab. Let's see how to generate SSL manually. Copy the public IP address indicated as public IP in the Outputs tab. Open the terminal and go to the directory where your private key is located. Paste the following command into your terminal and press Enter. SSH-I your key name Ubuntu at public IP address. Type yes and press enter. This will log you into the server. Paste the following command into your terminal and press enter. And follow the instructions. You can also find the command under the generate SSL section of the guide. sudo root certificate generate standalone.sh. Admin email is needed to generate SSL certificates. In our example, SSL certificate is already installed. Now you can access the Deep Sea Coder dashboard. You can find the API documentation in the developer guide. Enjoy Deep Sea Coder!